In this video, we're going to talk about the basic motion for conducting. And I have my favorite baton. Mine's the one with the wooden end. And um, we are going to talk about what kind of motion you are supposed to use when you're doing um, your conducting moves. Okay, <laughs> so I have a bow right here. And I'm just using the bow as a demonstration of where an ictus is. And an ictus is your imaginary line that you are going to bounce your baton off of. So the imaginary line needs to be somewhere around your stomach area. And um, if you're truly in front of an orchestra, you need to make sure your ictus is high enough that everyone in the orchestra can see where that is. So if you conduct down here, many of the people, especially in the front, will not be able to see you. If it's too high, then it's um, a little distracting. So somewhere comfortable right in here. So here's my ictus, my imaginary line that I'm using a bow to help me out. And a conducting pattern in four is down, and I bounce in, I bounce out, and up. Now, some people will say down, left, right, up. But I like to say down, in, out, up. So here are the clicks. That's my baton bouncing on the ictus. So I would like everybody to try this with me. And what we're going to do is we're going to try it at first two-handed. And this helps with the side-to-side -side coordination. And you can just have your hands out. You don't have to have anything fancy with your hands. You don't need a pencil in your hand. You can just wave your hands in the air. So do this with me now. Down, bounce in, bounce out, bounce up. So you don't do it, watch. You don't do straight, dun, dun, dun. It's down with a bounce. Down with a bounce, down with a bounce, down with a bounce. Okay, so let's try this again. Remember your imaginary line is somewhere around here. So ready? And you start around your eye level. Ready? Go. Down, in, out, up. Down, in, out, up. Down, in, out, up. Down, in, out, up up. So now I want you to try it one-handed. Now I know some of you are left-handed and yes you may conduct left-handed if you want. <clears throat> I think there are people who are left-handed who learn to conduct right-handed. Um, the other hand is supposed to show expression so you don't always do this with both hands at once although a lot of times your teachers will do that to help you really see where the beat is. So um, <clears throat> uh, let's try this one-handed. This is my right hand, but I'm going to conduct left-handed so that I'm mirroring you conducting right hand. If you're left-handed, you may use your left hand. Okay, start about your eye level. And we're going down, in, out, up, and we'll do four measures. One, two, ready, go. Down, in, out, up. Down, in, out, up down, in, out, up, down, in, out, up, down, in, out, up. I may have lost track of how many measures that was. All right, um, <clears throat> that basic motion has to, be, um, has to be very easy for you. It has to be second nature, like you can hold a conversation and um, maybe do math in your head, or um, talk about a vacation or a video game or something like that. You have to be able to do that while you're doing this beat pattern, okay? So now we're gonna try it faster. So let's go faster. And the bounce has to help the players see how fast the tempo is. So we're gonna go faster this time. Go ahead and take your right hand and put it up. We'll go one, two, ready, go. Down, in, out, up, down, in, out, up, down, in, out, up, down, in, out, up. Good. Now let's do slow, which is more difficult. 
Ready? One, two, ready, go. Down, in, out, up. Down, in, out, up. Down, in, out, up. Down, in, out, up. So notice I didn't go down, in, out, up, but my swirls between are giving the players an idea. Now, one last comment before the end of this video is, do you see how I'm wearing black? And if a conductor wears black and has a white baton, it makes it easy for the orchestra to see where the baton is. So notice down, in, out, up, down, in, out, up. That helps the orchestra see the motion of the baton.